Hi guys, so today I'm going to do a first impression review on the new Maybelline Dream Cushion Foundation. Um, I took off the sticker and I took off the sticker on the inside just to make sure that it will match me. Hopefully it will. Can't really tell still, but I haven't touched it. I haven't anything like that. So we'll see how it goes. Um, I am going to prime my skin just because I always prime my skin anytime I use a foundation. I don't think it'll be, for me, I don't think it'll be very effective to put a primer on half of my skin and not on the other side when I always prime my skin. So I'm just using um, some regular uh, primers. So first I'm going to be going in with my uh, Hangover X primer from Too Faced. It's a hydrating primer so it'll just help with my dry skin. I've also already um, filled in my eyebrows just because I always like to um, I started not always I just started filling in my eyebrows before before my foundation just so that there's not a lot of a uh, product in my eyebrows so now I'm, I'm gonna be going in with my Maybelline prime light primer and it's just a strobing and uh, pore minimizing. No, it's just a strobing and pore minimizing primer. So now on to the foundation. Um, I have the website right here and I'm trying to find the claims. Um, but there really aren't many claims. It just says um, Dream Cushion Fresh Face Liquid Foundation delivers complete luminous coverage for fresh faced perfection. And that's about it. Um, it says complete luminous coverage on the website but then on the back of the foundation it says medium coverage so i don't know we'll see um i'm in, i got the shade 20 a uh, classic ivory so i'm hoping it'll work i'm going to do the beauty blender on this side and i'm going to be using a flat top brush on my other side on my left side so we will see how this works. I'm going to go in with my Beauty Blender first. I'm not going to use this because I just don't use them anyways. Um, I love that it has a huge mirror. So that's really nice. So I'm just going to pounce it in once. It's a lot. Oh shit, that's a lot. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to use it on this side. Yeah, I guess that's a match. It's really cold. <laughs> Actually, holy shit, that's full coverage. Okay, I'm gonna put this inside. Holy crap. <gasps> that's full coverage. Oh. Get these little hairs out the way. Holy shit, this is full coverage. And I just dabbed it in once. I will say, though, with the Beauty Blender, there are little, um, there's like little, like, sponge marks, like dots, 
of this like you can see where the sponge kind of I don't know it's really weird I mean the full coverage is there it's really luminous and like hydrating which is nice a lot of people said that it's kind of like a satin to matte finish and they had dry skin so I was kind of nervous about this but I'm not really getting matte at all that's a lot okay I'm gonna go on the other side and just try to blend it out a little bit more on the tip of the nose I always forget the tip of my nose it's so funny <laughs> that's the only part that won't have foundation it's really weird okay now it's starting to blend out a little bit better it's not leaving marks as much wow that's really nice okay so so far I like it with the beauty blender side so now I'm gonna go in with a flat top brush and okay I'm gonna dip it in I'm just gonna touch it places I want the most coverage and then I've got a little pepperoni on my face so we're gonna cover that one up a little bit more okay and now we're gonna just buff it in I guess Okay, so I feel like I get more coverage with the Beauty Blender, but it might be because I'm not picking up a lot of product on my brush. Hmm. I kind of like how it looks on both sides. I don't know. It's really, really luminous, which I really like. I like to look hydrated just because I do have drier skin. Putting on a second layer to see how buildable it is. Just to see. color is pretty good too actually it, I feel like it looks a lot darker in the pan and the compact it looks a lot darker than when it comes out Okay, so for my first impressions, I like it so far. Okay, so for my first impression, I actually really like it. Um, I know it'll look really funny because I just have eyebrows and foundation on. But I really like it so far. It's actually really high in coverage. Um, it's really, really luminous. And I don't feel like I have a lot. And I didn't even put a lot either way. So, yeah. Um, I think I like it better with the Beauty Blender. But you could go both ways. It doesn't... It looks really good either way. I think it's just preference. Um, 
But yeah, I really like it. It's really buildable. Um, it's luminous. It's definitely luminous. Um, and it's got really good coverage. I'll see how I like it. And I'll probably update you guys in a favorites video. Um, or, you know, leave a comment below and I'll answer it that way. Or, yeah, I'll let you guys know how I like it. How it wears throughout the day. But... Usually for me, I don't know what it is, but usually um, if, I put, if I like the way that a foundation is when I first put it on, usually it's a really good foundation for me because with most foundations, it gets better throughout the day just because it tends to, it'll melt into my skin a little bit more with the heat, with my uh, body heat. So if I don't like a foundation at the beginning, usually it looks a little bit better later, but um... If it looks good right now, it usually looks really good later, so I really like it. Um, I hope that helps you guys um, thinking who are thinking about uh, purchasing the new foundation or looking for a new foundation. Um, I highly recommend this one so far. I really like it. Um, I'm definitely going to try it out a little bit more and see if I have the same opinion. And yeah, thanks so much for watching. I really hope this helped. Um, give this give this video a thumbs up if you really liked it. Um, leave a comment below of anything any kind of video that you have a suggestion for, and I'll be happy to accommodate you. All right, guys, I will see you in my next video. Bye.